Thank you for joining me for yet another week of the And Now We Know show. I am your special host, Johnny K. And what do you think I have today? A special guest. I always have special guests on my show. If you're just seeing me for the first time, I have so many people for you guys to go through and binge watch. I have chefs, I have comedians, I have musicians, I have rappers, singers, I have writers, um, fashion designers, all kinds of people. People are dropping barbecue sauces on here. I got like so many different things for you guys to check out. Today, of course, I have a very special guest. His name is King Gerald and he's been, you guys have probably already heard of him and if you haven't, this is a very interesting guy. I had to get him on the show because he's like doing a lot in these streets. He got like, he's a comedian. He has his karaoke showers and it's just like really hilarious to me. So I just want to cover that today and get to know like what is his story and how did he start doing this so yeah you guys sit down sit tight I got another great one for you um, let's bring him on out hello, hello. <laughs> hello thank you for coming on Thanks for having me. appreciate you so much you got body wash you guys yeah. you want to check those out first or no we, we'll go through it we're okay. gonna go through all of that all right, you guys, we're finally sitting here with King Gerald, and we, we have to get to know him today. It's a lot to get to know. Um, first thing I want to talk to you about is how did you fall in love with comedy? Well, I've always been, you know, I, I thought I was funny. I, I always thought I was funny in class in elementary. I used to get in trouble. I finished my work, and then I'll just start clowning, and it made everybody laugh. So I kind of found my safe space or my you know, my powers in making people laugh. Interesting. So like back all the way back in school. Yeah, so you've been funny for a long time. I have, I have. <laughs> I've always been a class fan. So I'm gonna talk about karaoke TV. Because yeah. karaoke TV is why you're here. Right. That's it's a big deal, you guys. Um stay tuned towards the end. I'll have the links to uh, his channel and all that for you guys to check out. Um so how did you come up with this idea? Because you it's a, it's karaoke inspired. Right, right. So, yeah, tell us. <laughs> so initially, I started with shower karaoke. For me, I love to sing in the shower. I love to rap in the shower. I think it's fun. I, I thought everybody loved to do it, find out they didn't, but I love to do it. I'm an electrician by trade, and I didn't want to do that for the rest of my life. So I was trying to think, what can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Mm -hmm. And I've always heard, do something that you love to do. Do something that you're passionate about. Right. And I love to joke and I love to sing in the shower so I'm like well, <laughs> well I was like well everybody is not going to want to see me every day so I'm like well if other people sing and dance in the shower maybe I can have them submit their videos yeah. and then I'll create a show from that and we'll see everybody else singing and laughing and dancing in the shower <laughs> and it's hilarious I love it and some people come on there and they really be thinking they can sing yeah, yeah. well I thought I could sing in the shower too <laughs> so you're right oh my gosh this is really funny it's a funny show I, I really did you mean for it to be comedy or like was it supposed to be serious at first well each contestant <laughs> is different so initially I was serious because I thought I could sing but <laughs> some people come on there for comedy some people are serious and they're really singing yeah so it just depends now it depends on the uh, the contestants with <laughs> with their agenda is so sometimes it's serious sometimes it's comedy initially it was serious for me but some wow. people are comedy Wow like your show is basically taking on a life of its own it's right. like doing its own thing and you have like three different avenues right you have street karaoke you have um power karaoke, power karaoke and and you have shark, shark. power karaoke right so like so karaoke tv is the umbrella on youtube that's right. the umbrella so then we talked about shower karaoke power karaoke i go around la or we've actually been further than that but so i'll say california and we go to uh karaoke bars karaoke lounges and we record the people with their consent of course to do karaoke so then we bring them <laughs> back and we edit it and everything and we create a show for you to see the people around the world or around california oh, doing wow. karaoke so do you want to take it to other states you want to go absolutely like, travel? absolutely i want it to be a syndicated show but now we're starting i'm gr in grind mode <laughs> right now uh, a guy a fan he told me uh why don't you go to different uh countries and, and i was I, gonna say I, you I had go out the country it, hadn't thought of it yet but now my I, mine is open yeah to why not it. absolutely the asians they have a big karaoke they love karaoke <laughs> oh, so. oh, i would dope. love to go out there exactly. ah, china I would love watch to. out china here he's <laughs> on his way he's coming y'all so be ready be ready china is there anybody that is like your favorite contestant Actually, the winner of last season's shower karaoke was my favorite contestant because he was serious. He had, <laughs> I, 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 he, What's he, his name? His name, oh my God. Wilt, Wiltshire BT on, okay. on Instagram. Wiltshire BT. 
So Shout out to you. He won the grand prize. That was the first season. It was one thousand dollars. Now it's the second season. The grand prize would be two thousand dollars. That's dope. Okay. You be giving people I money. Do. Do. Shout out to that. <laughs> How can people sign up to be a contestant for well, your show? Well, you can go to. Well, you can send your uh, videos into Shower Karaoke Videos at gmail.com. That's if you want to be in Shower Karaoke. If you want to be on uh, Power Karaoke, you can send your videos to Power Karaoke Videos at gmail.com. There's Street okay. Karaoke, that's random, so you can't really submit videos yeah. from there. Okay. Wow. But that's... go to YouTube, uh, Karaoke TV. Wow, that's such a big thing. Like, I love what you're doing. Yes. I really, like, hope you continue it. Like, I, I, I hope, am. I want to see you, like, around the world. I, I think it'll be dope. And that's then you should come back. I'll, 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 I absolutely will. I absolutely will. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I'll be in a different studio by then. Like, right. you know. <laughs> so, now I want to get into, like, your body wash. She has body wash, you guys. He has shampoo. I mean, can you tell us more about this over here? Yes. So, initially... I started this brand because of shower karaoke. I'm in the shower and I'm like, okay, well, they have soap, they have body wash, I can do my own in the shower. Uh -huh. But the irony in that is I became vegan maybe three months ago. So now all of these are natural products. I don't do the the chemicals or whatever. Uh -huh. Everything it's is like natural. Black soap? Exactly. Oh, Everything is natural. That's what I like. Yeah. That's what I like. Natural stuff. Everything is natural. Can you tell us about this shampoo? What's the, inside the shampoo? The shampoo is a shampoo and a conditioner. Natural products. I don't I'm not a chemist so I don't make the product, but I do assist on hey I want everything natural and you know specific but the specifics I'm not I'm not a chemist. <laughs> I'm just a comedian and a karaoke guy, but they're natural products. Wow, okay. Yeah. And can I smell it? You can. Mmm, it smells like peppermint. Yeah. It's like, oh, it's yeah. yeah. It's on the label, it should say peppermint on there. Or what? Some cedar of Cedar and lavender. Yeah, yeah. So this one, cedar mint. Yeah, so the Ooh. the different fragrances are on here vanilla rose. Awesome too. Then we have the. Ooh. Oh, this is like, it smells like luxury. Like, this smells rich. Luxury, yeah. Like a rich person. Man, so this is for guys. For the men, yeah. Oh, we have the Kings, the Natural Kings body wash, and the Natural Queens body wash. Wow, Natural Kings. I like the name too. Let me smell this one too. Go ahead. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's turn it to a smelling show. Mm -hmm. mm. Vanilla Rose. This is a rich smell too. Who helps you pick the scent? Well, me and my co producer. Oh, yeah. no. But that's what we did. We actually, we didn't just randomly pick. We did research on the, you know, the best smelling, the most popular scents, and we just formulated a scent. Wow, the men's one. I like the men's one the best. And yeah, yeah and we, we have, have the bar the bars. Soap. Yeah, bar soap, natural bar soap. Queen and Kings, natural king, and natural queen bar soap. The black wow. one is for men, the white one is for women for like they're more delicate so you guys as you're watching karaoke showers you can also make sure you're enjoying some of these products the body wash he has like the soap the shampoo everything you need in the shower literally is here and it's all natural like can't even get no better than that no better That's, than that all natural how do you maintain a like your family life your relationship life and having like a body wash, you're having co-producers you deal with, and you have contestants you have to deal with. How do you uh, balance all of that? Like, and friendships, how do you stay on top of your friendships and, and all that? To be 100% honest, there's no balance right now. I'm all, I'm all <laughs> I like your answer. <laughs> Honestly. I'm so glad. <laughs> Everything is dedicated to my brand. Everything is dedicated to uh, karaoke TV, Every, all my time no uh, everything is dedicated to it so there is no balance unfortunately <laughs> but hopefully as i grind it out and i get further then i will have balance but now if you're in grind <laughs> I, I suggest that too you can't really nourish a relationship or when you're not in grind mode it's, yeah, it's yeah. not really yeah. hard because you you're putting so much into it My you life, have to you have to put you yourself have to. you have to because if you that. don't you you could see what happens when you don't absolutely, absolutely. and like you know numbers absolutely. going down and everything absolutely. so it's like damn you got to stay on top of it you can't let nothing distract you literally for real, literally. For yeah. real. and like your family and everybody just got to understand yes yeah. and they do and they do the family i have they understand they they see the vision so they're like okay because right. that's that's i eat and breathe that when i wake up that's what i'm talking about and doing whether it's recording whether it's editing where there's whatever is selecting it's my life and then when I go to sleep, it's my life. Wow. That's how it has to be, though. Yeah. Like, if you want to be successful, you guys, 
that's honestly what it is. Absolutely, absolutely. The more There's you put no in, easy way. Yeah. The more you put in, the more you get out. So I'm putting everything in to get everything back. Right, that's how you have to yeah. do it. Yeah. You're a smart guy, very smart guy. Okay, so I want to kind of talk about your passion for music as well. Uh -huh. Because music is kind of like the stem of this. Mm -hmm. Like you started wanting to do karaoke yourself. Right. And, and now it's just formed into like this big thing for other people, right. a right. platform for others. Right. Um, when did you fall in love with music? I've always loved music. I wanted to be an artist, but I realized, well, I, I'm not going to say I can't sing, but <laughs> it's kind of real competitive. So I enjoy performing, I enjoy singing, I enjoy dancing. I might not be the best, so I'm like, well, I can do this. I enjoy this too. So everybody might not have the voice or the writing cr uh, creativity, but you can't do a cover and you can... Uh, you right. can kill it. You, you can kill it. And you can release covers right. now. Absolutely. Legally. Exactly. Exactly. And make money off it. Let's not talk AI. AI I know. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Would you put out some music? Absolutely. Some yes. Covers? Yes. So we can stay tuned for that? <laughs> Absolutely. Okay. I will come in. You, hey, look, I know, I I know engineers, people that can help you okay. uh, record something. Look, I got, I got, and I'll they do work it. with some dope people. So. I will do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's nothing. It's like, <laughs> Just get some studio time and right. get up in there. Right. I'll do it. Stay tuned, y'all. He gonna also have some music covers for us to listen to or probably some original music, maybe? Anything. Maybe? Anything. Okay, okay. If it comes from the heart, if it's, I'll do it. You're gonna have music <laughs> out. Dope, dope, dope. Um, can you shout out your social media for everybody so that we can find you, stalk you, and stay on absolutely, top of absolutely. everything? Do I look at the camera? Or, yes. Okay, social media. King Gerald Jones, uh, Instagram. I have a uh, shower karaoke videos on Instagram. We have power karaoke videos on Instagram. Last but not least, we have street karaoke videos on Instagram. Also go to YouTube, karaoke TV. Should I show the back of my jacket? Cause yeah. there's a couple of karaoke's that I wanna, but they have to look for this. Uh, hey, oh, that's a sick jacket, y'all. Can we buy this? Yeah, we got oh. merch, we got merch. <laughs> it's a part of the merch. So I, I just wanted to show them that because there's a few other karaoke channels, but this is the realest that one. So dope. you have to I look for it. that emblem. And you got the shirt. Yes. You got the t shirt too, y'all. Get y'all a t shirt. Get, get it, you a get jacket. It, get, it, get it. Oh my gosh. Especially the contestants. Right, right. All of them should be getting a code. That would be dope. That would be dope. And um, can you leave us with some words of motivation to people that are inspired by you today that are thinking of probably starting a channel like yours? Uh -huh. um, what type, type of advice would you give to those people? Uh, word of motivation is manifested. Think it first, whatever, whatever. I mean, absolutely, whatever you think it, think of, you can do it. Even if other people don't see the vision, even if, uh, even if you get a million no's, all it takes is one yes. But manifest it first, think about it, and put in hard work behind it. That's true. That's good advice. You guys visualize, picture it first, and then just go after it. And before you know it, it'll be it'll be there. Exactly. And it's that simple, to be honest with you. It really is. Yeah. Yeah. That's kind of how I started the show. Yeah. Like, <laughs> so yeah. Any, if you talk to anybody that has anything going on, successful or start where they're, they're grinding, manifest. You have to think it first, and it's going to happen. Right. Because I was like literally just sitting and thinking about it for a long time. Mm -hmm. And then just picturing how I would do it first. Right. And then actually started doing the steps. Like, let me get a banner or something. I didn't have a TV at first. I had like a little banner. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I used to, I don't know, I, on my channel, but it's way deep in there. I had a, a show called He Say, She Say with a, with a woman. And so I did the hosting thing, <laughs> the podcasting thing back in 2014. Oh, is it still up? It's still on there, yeah. But okay. it, there, it's 2014 video, right. so it's going to look like that. 2014 quality. <laughs> right, right. No 4K yet. Exactly, like exactly. <laughs> but it's up there. If you yeah. check out my season one, it's very <laughs> low quality <Yeah>. videos. <laughs> But yeah, it's good memories, good memories of how you started right, and stuff absolutely. like that, you absolutely. know, where you came from. It's good to see that. Um, so yeah, that's King Gerald, y'all. I'm so happy we interviewed him. Uh, and now we know King Gerald. Uh, everything we talked about today is in the description box below. Check him out, all those links to his, his YouTube channel, um, to stalk him, his Instagram. And that is it for this episode. Come back next week, like this video so it shoots up to the top. Leave some comments, put an emoji, say something, uh, put a smile face, you know, put some popcorn or something like that, you know, get us up in the algorithm. Put a and microphone. Put, put, put a microphone <laughs> or something like that. Karaoke, you know, post yourself doing a video or something like that. Tag us. You know what I'm saying? 
and uh come back next week you guys subscribe to subscribe to my channel and and now we know king gerald <laughs> see y'all next week thanks man of course thank you <laughs>